Hey, welcome to a new video. Australia is a country known for its unique and diverse fauna, housing over 600,000 species of animals. A significant portion of these animals are considered dangerous. Today we'll show you the 30 most dangerous animals in Australia. Are you new to this channel? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And before we start, also like the video. Number 30. The cane toad, also known as Toadzilla, was originally introduced to Australia in the 1930s in an attempt to control the population of beetles that were damaging sugarcane crops. Without natural predators, they're considered highly dangerous to native Australian wildlife. This is because they're toxic to many predators that try to eat them. The toads secrete a poisonous substance through their glands on their skin. On January 12, 2023, a giant cane toad was spotted by a park ranger in Conway National Park in the state of Queensland. Weighing 6 pounds, or 2.7 kilograms, it broke the world record and was named Toadzilla. Unfortunately, it didn't survive, but if it had, it could have laid up to 35,000 eggs. Number 29. Australian huntsman spiders are a group of large and fast spiders, known for their long legs and typically brown or gray color. Unlike most spiders that weave webs to catch prey, these spiders actively hunt and chase their prey, injecting them with venom. They're often found in homes and other buildings, where they feed on insects and other small creatures. Due to their size and speed, they can be quite intimidating. Nine out of ten times, they prefer to run away, but mothers will fight you, and although their venom is not lethal to humans, it can cause nausea and headaches. Number 28. The Portuguese man o' war is a jellyfish like marine creature that often floats in large groups of over a thousand individuals. These animals are usually found in waters and close to the water's surface, using their distinctive, translucent blue and purple sails to move through the currents. The jellyfish is known for its long floating tentacles, which are equipped with stinging nematocysts, microscopic capsules containing harpoons filled with venom. These stinging capsules can be activated by even a slight touch and are capable of paralyzing and killing small fish and crustaceans. Although the jellyfish is rarely deadly to humans, its venom can cause extreme pain and long-lasting welts on the skin. Number 27. The tiger quoll is an intriguing but potentially dangerous animal found in Australia. Its habitat includes various landscapes, from dense forests to rainforests, mainly in eastern and southeastern parts of Australia, including Tasmania. As the largest surviving marsupial carnivore on the continent, it commands respect for its predatory nature and powerful hunting capabilities. With its sharp teeth, strong jaws, and a preference for hunting a variety of prey, including small mammals, birds, and even marsupials, it's undoubtedly a formidable predator. Encountering one is a rare event, but caution is advised. Their carnivorous instincts and agility makes them skilled hunters, and they may feel threatened if approached, leading to a defensive behavior. Number 26. Bulldog ants are a group of large, aggressive ants that can bite and sting and are mainly found in Australia. They're known for their large size, usually ranging from 0.6 to 1.2 inches, or 1.5 to 3 centimeters long and they use their powerful jaws for defense and capturing prey. They're also known for their painful stings, delivered by a sharp sting at the end of their abdomen, causing intense pain that can last for hours or even days. Besides their painful stings, these ants are capable of spraying formic acid from the abdomen, causing skin irritation and inflammation. Number 25. Particularly, the southern cassowary is often considered the most dangerous bird in the world due to the harm it can cause when provoked. These birds are naturally shy and can be difficult to spot in the wild, especially in their natural rainforest habitat. However, if a southern cassowary feels threatened, it can become aggressive and use its dagger-like claws to inflict potentially deadly wounds. In such situations, whatever happens, do not crouch or lie down, as it increases the risk of an attack. Interestingly, violent male southern cassowaries are responsible for incubating the eggs and raising the chicks, which can take up to nine months. You definitely don't want to be around them during that time. Number 24. The miscellaneous spider is known to be quite aggressive and adopts an attacking posture when threatened. Their venom can be highly toxic and poses a serious danger to humans if bitten. Most of them are brown, but some have brightly colored markings, ranging from vivid blue to bright red. Additionally, the venom from this spider can cause skin necrosis, leading to the development of deep and painful wounds. However, there's also good news. Prompt treatment with the right antivenom can reduce the effects of the bite and prevent complications. 
Don't wait to see if symptoms occur, but seek professional medical care as soon as possible. Number 23. If it looks like a snake and has the pattern of a tiger, then it's best to run away as quickly as possible. Tiger snakes are a venomous snake species, native to South Australia, including Tasmania and coastal islands. They're widely known as one of the most dangerous snakes in Australia due to their highly toxic venom. They have distinctive bands that strongly resemble the stripes of a tiger, hence their name. What makes them 10 times scarier is that tiger snakes are agile climbers and can easily ascend trees and other structures, often reaching heights of up to 33 feet or 10 meters above the ground. They can also survive in polluted, water-rich environments, whereas other snakes can't tolerate that. Whereas other snakes can't tolerate it. Number 22. Great white sharks are the apex predators, which means they have no natural enemies in the ocean. Australia is home to more than 182 shark species, making it one of the most shark-rich areas in the world. Australia is also the second most popular country for shark cage diving, with the Great Barrier Reef being a popular diving spot to get up close to sharks. It's their size, speed, and powerful jaws full of sharp teeth that make the great white sharks so dangerous. In Australia, great white sharks are responsible for numerous unprovoked and sometimes fatal attacks on humans. These attacks mainly occur in areas where people enter the water to surf or swim, and great white sharks can sometimes mistake humans for prey such as seals. Number 21. The Australian magpie is a well-known and widespread bird species found throughout Australia. While these birds are often admired for their beautiful black and white plumage, they're also known to be potentially dangerous. During the breeding season, between July and November, they can become aggressive, especially when people get too close to their nests. They're intelligent birds, capable of recognizing human faces, and often carry out attacks on people they perceive as threats. There are several frightening videos of people on bicycles being swooped upon by the bird. This defensive behavior is known as swooping attacks, where the bird dives down at high speeds toward the perceived threat, targeting the head and eyes. Local residents often wear hats or carry umbrellas during the breeding season to protect themselves. Number 20. The blue ringed octopus is one of the most venomous animals in the world and can kill a human with just one bite. The venom of these octopuses contain tetrodotoxin, a potent neurotoxin that can cause respiratory failure and paralysis. Despite their small size, they are highly toxic and should be handled with extreme caution, or honestly not at all if you can avoid it. The blue rings in their tentacles serve as a warning to potential predators, and they display these rings when they feel threatened. The blue ringed octopus does not actively hunt humans, and it'll only bite in self-defense, or if it feels threatened. Due to the highly toxic nature of their venom, there's currently no anti-venom available for humans, so it's best to stay away from them. Number 19. The cicada killer is a large solitary wasp species, belonging to the genus Fesius. Despite their intimidating name, these wasps are generally not dangerous to humans and are not known for being aggressive unless directly threatened. However, they can be considered dangerous to cicadas, which serve as their primary prey. The female species is equipped with a formidable stinger that they use to paralyze their prey. Some females can grow up to 5 centimeters long, an impressive size for a wasp. In Australia, they are found in various regions throughout the country, as they prefer warm and dry climates. They're often seen in open areas such as gardens, parks, and sandy and gravelly soils where they build their burrows. Number 18. Stonefish can be found in shallow coastal waters and river estuaries along the Australian coastline. They're among the most venomous fish species and are considered highly dangerous to humans. Its dorsal fin contains a total of 13 sturdy spines that can deliver a highly toxic venom. If stung by a spine, the venomous sting can cause extreme pain, swelling, and potentially fatal consequences. Fortunately, stonefish are only dangerous if stepped on or handled. This is certainly something you want to watch out for, as stonefish have the ability to camouflage itself effectively. Number 17. Kangaroos are not the friendly animals you might think they are. Both male and female kangaroos are large, powerful, and known to cause injuries to humans. Did you know that they can also pick fights with your dog? Additionally, kangaroos are most active at night in Australia, and collisions unfortunately happen sometimes. The reason they're dangerous is because they have sharp claws and powerful hind legs. An interesting fact is that kangaroos have one of the strongest hind legs of all animals in the world. With their hind legs, they can jump to amazing heights and even deliver a powerful kick that can be deadly. Number 16. 
The giant centipede is a formidable and dangerous arthropod that occurs in various regions of Australia. They're known for their impressive size and predatory nature, and it can reach a length of up to 20 centimeters. The giant centipede can have up to 21 pairs of legs, and each leg is equipped with sharp claws, which they use to capture and immobilize their prey. Once they found their victim, they inject a potent venom through their sharp fangs. The venom contains enzymes that helps break down tissues, making it easier for the centipede to consume its meal. Although the giant centipede's venom isn't considered life-threatening to humans, its bite can be extremely painful. Additionally, it can cause swelling and allergic reactions, leading to more severe symptoms. Number 15. The goanna is a large predatory lizard native to Australia. This impressive reptile can reach a length of up to 6.5 feet, or 2 meters, and has developed an array of intimidating weaponry suitable for catching prey. They're formidable creatures, equipped with long claws and sharp teeth that enable them to climb trees easily. They're mainly active during the day, and mostly hunt in the early morning and late afternoon. With their powerful muscles, they can evade danger, and they also possess venomous saliva, which they produce in oral glands. However, the venom is not as dangerous to humans as snake venom, and there's no known cases of fatalities. Number 14. The Australian brown snake is one of the most venomous snakes in Australia, and is responsible for the majority of snake bites in the country. They've developed venomous saliva that's highly toxic to humans. Their venom contains neurotoxins that can rapidly shut down the central nervous system, leading to paralysis and deadly complications. They have an aggressive temperament, and are willing to attack when they feel threatened. While other snakes tend to avoid humans, the Australian brown snake will often stand its ground or even approach people in response to a perceived threat, rather than fleeing. They can move quickly and are well camouflaged, making them difficult to avoid if disturbed. Number 13. The tiger shark is a large and powerful shark species known for its dangerous nature. They're named for their distinct dark stripes on their sides, resembling the pattern of a tiger. Hence the name tiger shark. In Australia, they're commonly found in the coastal waters of the northern and eastern regions, including the Great Barrier Reef. One of the main reasons tiger sharks are considered dangerous is their reputation as opportunistic predators. They have a broad diet, including fish, sea turtles, marine mammals, seabirds, and even other sharks. They're known to scavenge and are sometimes called the garbage cans of the sea, due to their ability to consume a wide variety of items. Tiger sharks can pose a risk to swimmers, surfers, and divers, especially in areas where human activities coincide with their natural habitat. While attacks on humans are relatively rare, encounters with tiger sharks do occur, warranting vigilance when swimming or engaging in water activities. Number 12. Dingoes are wild dogs that occur in Australia and are generally considered to be tame. However, there have been cases where dingoes have attacked humans, usually when they feel threatened or cornered. Dingoes are known to keep an eye on people, but in most cases, they won't attack unless they feel provoked or if you get too close to their territory. They protect their land and young at all costs, and their aggression is often a defense mechanism. And chances are, you won't encounter just one dingo. As pack animals, they live in groups and are skilled hunters, capable of catching prey much larger than themselves. Number 11. The Australian sea wasp is a highly dangerous and venomous species of box jellyfish, found in the waters around Australia. This sea creature is considered one of the most venomous jellyfish in the world, and is a great danger to those who come into contact with it. The danger lies in its potent venom, which is released through the specialized tentacles hanging from its bell-shaped body. These tentacles can grow up to 10 feet or 3 meters long, making it a formidable predator in its underwater habitat. The venom contains toxins that target the nervous system, heart, and skin, which can lead to potentially severe and even deadly consequences for those stung. It's crucial for swimmers, snorkelers, and divers in Australian waters to be aware of the potential risk and take necessary precautions. Number 10. The tick is one of the most dangerous parasites in Australia. The tick's saliva contains a toxin that's deadly to animals and humans. The toxin can cause paralysis in muscles, including the heart and lungs, resulting in respiratory problems and even fatal outcomes. It's also very challenging to avoid them. Ticks are found in many places in Australia, especially in coastal areas. They're common in warm and humid environments, and it's difficult to avoid these areas as ticks can attach themselves to clothing, people, or other warm-blooded animals. The symptoms of a tick bite may not appear until several days later, making it difficult for people to take immediate action. Once the symptom occurs, it may already be too late. Number 9. 
The red-back spider is known for its striking red markings and causes a range of symptoms in humans after a bite. The venom of this spider is neurotoxic and affects the functioning of the nervous system. It can cause intense pain, muscle weakness, and even paralysis. They're also dangerous in other ways. Redback spiders are highly prolific, and a single female can lay up to 10,000 eggs. This means they can quickly form large populations, and locating and removing them can be quite difficult. They can also be challenging to identify, as their markings can vary, especially in younger spiders. This makes it difficult for people to know whether they're dealing with a redback spider or another species. Number 8. The platypus is the only venomous mammal found exclusively in Australia. The venom in its saliva is unique among mammals and consists of a cocktail of different proteins. The exact composition of the venom may vary, depending on the location of the population and even the individual animal. The venom is delivered through spurs on the hind legs of the male during the mating season, with the largest and most venomous spurs found on the hind legs. The venom serves multiple purposes, including disabling prey, defending against predators, and establishing dominance during the mating season. When a platypus attacks, it may first give a warning growl or hiss. If the threat persists, it can inflict multiple bites with its bill, which is covered with sharp spurs. Number 7. Stingrays are a family of rays that are commonly found in tropical coastal waters, including Australia. The venom of a stingray is located in the spines on their tail, which they use for self-defense. The spines are needle-like structures covered with serrated edges and are capable of injecting a large amount of venom. The most common symptoms of a stingray are intense pain, swelling, and redness at the side of the sting. In some cases, the venom can lead to muscle cramps, vomiting, diarrhea, and even seizures. Stingrays are generally not aggressive towards humans and will only sting if provoked or threatened. The most common way people get stung by a stingray is by accidentally stepping on them, especially in shallow water, where they can be difficult to see. Number 6. Cone snails are among the most venomous animals on Earth, and their venom is enough to take 700 human lives. The venom is a complex cocktail of various toxins, including peptides that can affect the victim's nervous system. They use their venom for both defense and capturing prey. They use a harpoon-like tooth called a radula to inject their venom. The venom then paralyzes the victim's muscles, making it easy for them to catch their prey. These snails are found in various marine environments, including coral reefs and rocky coasts. In Australia, they can be found in the waters of the Great Barrier Reef, the Northern Territory, and parts of New South Wales. Number 5. While bull sharks might not be the largest shark species, their aggressive behavior and powerful jaws make them one of the most dangerous shark species. They're known for multiple attacks per year. The name bull shark comes from their short, stout body shape and bull-like appearance. They also exhibit powerful behavior and are known to ram their prey to stun or immobilize them before attacking. Bull sharks are found in both saltwater and freshwater environments and can tolerate a wide range of salinities, allowing them to travel far inland through river systems. They're primarily carnivores and feed on a wide range of prey, including fish, other sharks, and even marine mammals. They're also opportunistic and known to scavenge and steal catches from other predators. Number 4. The venom of the inland tapin snake is a neurotoxin that can cause paralysis and even death within 45 minutes. It's extremely potent and causes paralysis of the respiratory muscles, leading to a breathless end. This venom is powerful enough to take down large animals, such as cows, within a few hours of being bitten. The snake is known for its aggressive nature and is willing to attack without provocation. They're quick in delivering bites and are known to bite multiple times, injecting large amounts of venom with each bite. The frightening aspect is that they can strike from a distance of up to two-thirds of their body length. This means that even if you think you're at a safe distance, you could be within range of the bite. Number 3. The Sydney funnel web spider is a highly venomous and dangerous spider species found in Australia. It's native to the eastern region of New South Wales, including the metropolitan area of Sydney. They can mainly be found in wooded areas, suburban gardens, and, and prefer moist and sheltered habitats. The spider is infamous for its aggressive behavior and potent venom, making it one of the deadliest spiders in the world. Their venom contains neurotoxins that can rapidly affect the nervous system and lead to serious medical issues if not treated. The male species in particular are aggressive and may display aggressive behavior when they feel threatened. If a person's bitten, it's essential to seek immediate medical help. The venom can cause a range of symptoms, including intense pain, swelling, sweating, increased heart rate, and potentially fatal consequences if not promptly addressed. Number 2. 
The box jellyfish is one of the most dangerous and venomous creatures in the waters around Australia. This jellyfish is known for its box-shaped bell and long tentacle-like appendages hanging from each corner. It's primarily found in the coastal waters of northern Australia, including the Great Barrier Reef, and can also be seen in the waters of Queensland, the Northern Territory, and Western Australia. These jellyfish are considered extremely hazardous due to its potential venom, which contains toxins that can quickly lead to severe stings and potentially life-threatening reactions in humans. Their tentacles can grow up to 10 feet or 3 meters long, and each tentacle is covered with thousands of tiny harpoon-like nematocysts. When the jellyfish brushes against human skin, the nematocysts fire their venom, causing intense pain and immediate skin welts. Besides the pain, the venom can cause a range of symptoms, including nausea, vomiting, breathing difficulties, and, in severe cases, cardiac arrest. The sting of a box jellyfish can be deadly, especially if the victim is stung multiple times or doesn't receive immediate medical assistance. Number 1. Saltwater crocodiles are considered one of the most aggressive crocodile species in the world and the most dangerous animals in Australia. They're notorious for their potential dangerous interactions with humans and possess a powerful bite that can be fatal. These enormous crocodiles can grow up to 20 to 23 feet, or 6 to 7 meters in length, and weigh over a ton. They inhabit the coastal waters, swamps, and rivers of northern Australia, primarily in the remote areas of the country, such as Queensland and Western Australia. What makes saltwater crocodiles so dangerous is their aggressive and opportunistic nature. They're highly skilled hunters and have an excellent ability to stalk and attack their prey, often without any warning. They can strike in a matter of seconds and drag a prey, including humans, underwater. It's crucial to follow warning signs and local advice when venturing into areas where saltwater crocodiles live for safety reasons. Swimming in approved and secured swimming areas is essential, and staying away from waterways where these crocodiles may be present is paramount. Ignoring warnings and engaging in reckless behavior around saltwater crocodiles can have serious consequences and is strongly discouraged. Respecting the natural habitat of these dangerous predators is vital to avoid human-crocodile conflicts and ensure the safety of people. Would you like to visit Australia? Let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos we've made, click one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.